Wow. Mm -mm -mm. That's a good looking truck there. And tractor. What is happening? Do you guys see that? Something's... Something's happening. I don't... Uh, what is this going on? Something is definitely happening here. We are back in the 50s. We are bringing back our farm out in there. Mm. I think I'm going to be the envy of the whole countryside. Going to pull in here, fill up with some old gas. Stop at the old diner. What we got here? Is that an old Chevrolet? Looks like. Don't really see them lowered all the time. We'll park out of everyone's way over here. There we go. Oh, yeah. She's taking a beating. But the power wagon, still a ticking. Bringing back our McCormick Farm L. M. Oh. Looks like neighbor Bob is going by. Well, that must be his wife. See you later, buddy. Not sure who that is. You usually don't see odd people around here. It's a very small farming community. I just love this diner's meatloaf. Mmm, can't wait to get some in my belly. Oh, man. Whew, I feel so refreshed. Got a little, I got a lot of stuff in my stomach. Oh, yep, yep. But it's time to get to business here. We were, I did say we're going to fill it up. I think I'm going to put a top off the Farm LM with fuel. So we can go right to the field. Drive this around here. Make sure, yeah, I think I'm going to not hit their overhang here. Fill up with a little gasoline. Usually somebody comes out here and pumps my gas for me. I don't know where they're at right now. Better pick up some uh, oil can here. I'm not used to somebody not pumping my gas out here. I thought they always pump the gas. Well, I guess I'm going to have to figure out how to operate this myself. Alright, start this old baby up. Start heading back to the farm. Uh, we're gonna clear everything. Yep. Yep. Alright. Alright. Put the blinkers on. Nothing to see here. Just driving back from the old McCormick dealership here. My new purchase. Needed to. Uh, Pull probably uh, maybe a four or a five. Yeah, probably should probably stick with a four bottom plow. But that is going to be the envy of the whole neighborhood. Yep. Moving into the big dogs now. Now, uh, this is definitely an operation I would like to move up to. Old Jimmy Bob's place over here. Whew. He has definitely got a oh, advanced dairy operation going there. Somebody's coming up here. Ooh, we got a lot of nice cars running around the streets here. Oh, is that an old uh, panel van there? Alright, we're coming up to our farm right here in the beautiful countryside of Wisconsin here. Yep, we got a dairy operation, beef cattle operation. Look at our heifers out there in the grass. Mm. Speaking of them, I think they were balling. We probably need to end up going to feed them before we start hooking up to the plow. Here we go. My lovely wife, Mary. 
I don't think she's going to be happy that I stopped by the diner and ate lunch without telling her prior to. Alright, that's going to be kind of an adventure getting this old uh, tractor off that. I think I'm just going to run it off the front end. Or maybe I should have parked that up by a ditch and then ran it up. Park it into a ditch. Maybe run it along the side of this, uh, our little, uh, hayloft here. Alright. 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 Got her off the old hay wagon there. Oh, yeah. This thing will pull some plows around here now. Yep. Might have to retire the old, uh, 7020 over here. Got this old beast. She uh, struggles a little bit with that four bottom plow. Let's just say that. All right, open this door up. So, uh, yep, let's just say we collect a lot of stuff. So we got an old army deuce here. We got an old Ford cab over here. Yep, we uh, probably need to uh, take her over to the garden hose and wash her off there a little bit gotten Oliver Super 88. Now this is one of our biggest tractors on the farm here. We put her on an old loader tractor. Yep, she runs the old hay. And that's one of the things we're going to have to do here right quick. Got old Massey here. Part the old farm aisle in the shed here for right now. Yep, it's got an upgraded uh, Ernest, I believe, front wheel assist on it. One of the first ones around this area. We got a whole 40 head of cattle, one of the biggest herds around this area, and 80 acres to farm in this beautiful countryside of Wisconsin. It's a lot of work, especially just for a few people. I do have a farm hand around here, but he isn't showing up just yet. He likes going by the nickname Farm Boy because he is one he just loves loves being on the tractor plowing some fields alright first gotta give the yearlings a little uh, hay here this up. Make sure they are nice and fed over here. Oop. Probably gave you too much there, didn't I? Whoa. Alright. Get some more. So we get the mamas fed so they can make us some uh, beautiful milk some of this hay on the old uh, backwards hay rack here. Alright. Fill her on up. Clamp her down there. There we go. Alright. Drive it over here to our beautiful Jersey cattle over here. Alright. Open up this fence. There we go. How's it going here, mamas? Alright, I'm gonna put a little bit to your old uh, hay feeder here. Go. Fill you on up. I'm gonna put the rest over here into their feed trough. Back it on up. Thing I like about this old thing. Got great three point on it. Alright, put this in here. Yep, we're definitely going to have to put a few loads over here into the feed trough. Now that's done for the old Jersey cattle find out that the gate's open, we better get out of here. Alright, yeah, we're going here, mamas. 
Look at our beautiful cattle herd out here, out in the pasture. What's up, Daisy? Yep, yep. Come and get your breakfast here. Start her back up. Probably should have just uh, left her outside. Oh yeah. He runs like a top. Now, uh, I'm sorry here. I'm gonna have to retire you. Or at least find another job here for you. Alright, she's not the right color. But, uh, she's gonna have to do, I guess. Alright, head on back here, right behind the house. Back up here, make nice straight rows. Start doing some plowing. Here we go. Definitely gonna be here a while. Should hopefully get this done in uh, a day, maybe two. Never know here on these plows. It definitely takes a while. Neighbors coming by over there. Got his Jeep out here. Right over here. Put it down. Here we go. Plowing the old field behind the house. Yep. Do uh, probably get the old harrow out. Level this out. Well, you could be planting some corn right away here. been a long hard day but she's done get the back 20 all plowed up what's going on Sam all right yep yep still got many acres still to do yep this old boy gonna have to get the old farm boy help me pl plow these fields up Ooh, yeah. So if you like this type of series, make sure to leave it down in the comment. I just wanted to do something different because you know what? Everyone does the same thing around here in this farming. So I just like to change it up a little bit. Maybe try to see if we can make a farm. We can make a living back here in the 50s. You know, where, uh, you know, everyone worked from sun up to sundown. No one ever complained. And majority of people were in the farm fields and not in the cities. Just want to try this out here. If you enjoy this, make sure you smash that like button. You know, leave it down in the comments. And also, if you haven't figured it out, it is really hard finding 50s farming equipment year in Farming Simulator 19. So if you can help me out, you know, maybe if you know a couple mods that we could use over here on the farm, make sure you leave them or let me know where to find them. But 
thank y'all for watching, and I will see you next time. We're here in the beautiful state of Wisconsin, Marksville. Alright, moving to our big field, the 40 acres. Well, there's old Billy's. What's up? Uh, my horn. Oh, I forgot. Don't have a horn on this old girl. You like to play with all these mods and more? Check out Apex Game Bay PCs. They make a PC for everyone's dream. Just use code SQUAD. They'll custom make it to your dreams with 10% off.